Hi friends, welcome back to Mama Jan's world. Today, I'm going to do an unboxing, actually my very first unboxing. And that's why I'm celebrating with some champagne over here. Um, and this is something I consider the perfect Valentine's gift for everyone. Um, and it's a company that I just recently heard of. I don't know where I've been hiding, but um, I hear a lot of YouTubers talk about this designer candy called Sugarfina. So here's a box from Sugarfina. And look at it. Even the packaging is beautiful. It's got the Tiffany blue and the white. And this one was purchased in Vancouver. Uh, where I live um, and actually this was a Chinese New Year gift from one of my husband's clients uh, for Chinese people during Chinese New Year time we love to give each other sweets because it you know it's a representation of sweetness in life so this client obviously has very good taste and she got some designer candies for us. Um, so I'm just going to take this beautiful box out. Um, this is a candy bento box. And it's got a beautiful bow and it says, But first cocktails, candy bento box. Well, she doesn't know me, but... <laughs> This is perfect for me. Um, so in this bento box, there's eight types of candies. The first one are champagne bears. Second is peach balini gummies, and they're all listed at the back here. Uh, champagne bubbles, martini olives, blood orange negroni. Uh, I'm not sure if I pronounced that right. Bubbly bears. Rosé Roses, and Jamaican Rum Snowballs. Ooh, fancy. Um, and I believe they have boutiques all over the US and Canada. And why this is a really great Valentine's gift is because I actually checked their website and they have a very cool program where all you need is your recipient's email and they will actually send the candy to the recipient so you pick a gift um i guess you can say i want three boxes of candies or whatnot to this person this person can log on and choose their own candies and there's tons of candies different strokes for different folks kind of candies uh there's you know boozy candies like these there's healthy gummies for the health nut. They have vegan candies. Just any type of candy you can think of, you can find on this website. Um, I read a little backstory about them. So it's about this couple who thought, hey, why not make candies for adults? You know, when you were a kid and you go to a candy shop and you're so excited because you get to pick your candies. I mean, my sons love the candy shop right so they thought we're gonna make a very sophisticated candy shop and source the best candies from all over the world so these candies are sourced from I think uh, like Germany or F France or even Japan all over the world so let's get to the unboxing Ooh, I'm so excited Here you go, let's see. Um, how do I open this? Oh, right, let me slide it out. Okay, I have to slide this out. And then you get the box. And there's a little tab here. And you open it. Wow, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And there, oh, and there's a description of all the different candies here. Um, so there's the rosé and brut champagne, there's the peach bellini from Germany, 
and the champagne bubbles made from the USA, uh, Jamaican rum balls from Germany, dirty martini. Ooh, I love dirty martini, so I can't wait to try that one. Um, there's a the blood orange gold that's made in Italy, and the champagne fizz from Germany, and the rosé roses made from Germany. So let's see how they taste. Ooh, I think I'll do it from my uh, random order, I guess. So these are the um, Brut and Rosé Champagne. And let's see. They are gummies. And oh my goodness, look at that packaging. It is beautiful. Ooh, so I took a light yellow one. Okay, guys, I'm not really into gummies. Um, and this gummy, I have to say, tastes good, but nothing spectacular. But the, uh, the description here says, made with Dom Perignon champagne, these sophisticated bears sparkle in flavors of root and rosé. So, it's a nice gummy, but I'm not gonna go out my way to get it. So let's try the next one. Ooh, the peach Bellini. I used to love the you know peach gummies that you can get that's very similar to this. But let's see how this one is. So you know like the round ones that you get from um, you know the candy store at the drugstore but these are in a heart shape and let's see what the description says in the back these all natural gummies are filled with juicy peach nectar and dusted in sweet sour crystals Oh yeah. These gummies, I have to say, are like a grade A type of peach gummy. I do like these. So, I'm going to cleanse my palate a little bit. I love champagne, guys. It's my favorite drink. Um, let's try. Well, let's let's keep on with the gummy um, trend and try the Negroni uh, gummies. There they are. Okay. And sorry, guys. This is actually my husband's fancy camera I'm using to film, and I don't quite know how to get the right lighting, etc. So I'll improve with time. Um, let's see. So let's see how these Negroni gummies are. So these ones are quite small. They're like those little gummy drops. Um, look, they're like teeny tiny. Mmm. I like these. These are like the soft kind of gummies and not as chewy as the other two. And it says, these juicy, tiny fruit gems are infused with blood orange nectar, then rolled in Italian sugar crystals. I guess Italian sugar crystals taste better. Mm. Actually, I'm gonna try another one. Because that one was so small. Mm. Yeah. 
these gummies melt in your mouth. They're very soft. They have a very soft texture. Pretty yummy. Alright. So, but the, the taste is pretty strong, so again, I need to, you know, clean my taste buds a little bit to prepare for the next one. So the next one I have is the Champagne Fizz. And this one is our classic champagne bears are dusted with tart sugar crystals for a sophisticated taste that really pops. So again, this is the Champagne Fizz. Okay. Okay, I'll try a um this orangey color one. I definitely like this one, the Champagne Fizz Bears, more than the Brut and Rosé Champagne Bears. Um, I think it's because this one is more like a sour gummy, and they're both like we really got a really chewy texture, but I don't know, this one just got a little bit more sour taste to sort of balance out the whole thing. I quite enjoyed that one. Okay, and the last gummy. Let's see. So this one is the rose gummy. Oh, rose roses gummy. Oh, and look, look. It's little roses. Okay, little roses. So it says, it's made with rose wine from Provence. These refreshing gummy roses are the perfect seaside treat. Oh, sorry, shoreside treat. I actually quite like these ones. Um, again, they're the rose. Do I have upside down? No. Rose. Roses and actually, they do taste kind of like rose. And okay, rose for me is a hit and miss. I do love drinking rose, but more often than not, you don't get a very good rose. So it's hard to actually find a good rose. And this, I guess, is what a good rose tastes like in a gummy. All right. Let's try the other three types of candies. Um, oh, I'll try the one that I was really looking for to call the dirty martini. Um, <laughs> it's so cute. They're like little olives in here. And oh, the white chocolate almonds. No olives here. Just smartly dressed white covered almonds masquerading as cocktail garnishes. Mm. Exciting. Let's see. Oh my goodness, so super cute. Look at this. It's like an olive with the little red pimante kind of red pepper dot. Mmm. By far my most favorite. It's basically a white chocolate covered almond, but it's really nice white chocolate. Uh, I don't know. I guess sometimes white chocolate, I don't know. They just seem kind of bland to me, for lack of a better word. But this one is super good. Yep, I recommend that one. The dry martini chocolate almond. Okay. Yeah. Little champagne. <sighs> Love this. 
this is really fun. I love trying these candies. I mean, I have to be honest, I think so far my husband can have all the gummies because I guess I'm not a gummy fan, but if you like gummies, you can tell those ones are high class gummies. Um, this one I just opened is a Jamaican snowball. And uh, let's read the description here. Oh, it's chocolate rum truffles. These creamy truffles are infused with Jamaican rum, then finely dusted in powdered sugar. And it's made from Germany. Okay. So they look like a little snowball. These are nice. You can definitely taste the rum. So basically, it's exactly like the description said. It's this creamy rum chocolate covered with a sugar coating. So, I think this brings us to our last chocolate box. And these are the champagne bubbles. And look, it's so cute. It's got like little, those little bubble candies to make it look like bubbles. I quite like these ones too. It's just like um, the champagne gummies I had but it's covered with these tiny little like candy balls so that's a bit of texture to them and yeah it's actually quite tasty so i do like these ones as well the champagne bubbles um so if i had to rank them i would say my favorite oops just knocked the camera um my favorite is the Dirty Martini. Those are really good. Then the Jamaican Rum. I really love that too. Um, and probably my third choice would be the Blood Orange Negroni. Because that one... Can you see? Yeah, that one, you know... It's got an interesting texture. So, there's my little review of the Sugarfina candies. Please remember to thumbs up, like, or subscribe. Um, and please leave a comment for me. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>